hello everyone welcome to pharma rocks youtube channel in today's video we will solve pharma quiz part number 15 so welcome to pharma rocks the way of success today's quiz the topic is antiemetic drugs from subject pharmacology so instructions first of all welcome to pharma rocks youtube educational channel in this video we will solve pharmacy related mcqs it means multiple choice questions so here are the quiz rules for you rule number one there are a total 10 mcqs rule number two each questions each correct answer carries four marks rule number three incorrect answer will leads to deduction of mark and negative mark is minus one time limit is 15 minutes so you may pause the video for noting down the answer and resume the video for knowing the correct answer comment your score after completion of test so how you will make the evaluation of your marks so if you get the marks between 30 to 40 then your preparation is excellent marks between 20 to 30 indicates the preparation is good Marks between 10 to 20 indicates average preparations and need to improvement. And 0 to 10 marks means poor preparations and need to study more to qualify the exam. So let's start and evaluate yourself before the exam and comment your score after completion of test. Subscribe our channel for such more educational videos and click on the bell icon so you will get the notification when we will upload such new video on our YouTube channel related to GPAT, NIPER, DI and pharmacist exam. So let's start the quiz and solve the questions carefully. We provide you answer after 5 to 10 seconds after each question. So here is the question number one is for you is Ondansetron is Option R Second generation antihistaminic drug Option B Drug for peptic ulcer Option C New antiarrhythmatic drug and Option D Antiemetic for cancer chemotherapy so you may pause the video for think about the correct answer so the correct answer for this question is option d antiemetic for cancer chemotherapy so ondansetron is a antiemetic drug for cancer chemotherapy question number two ondansetron blocks Emetogenic impulses at the following sites. The options are vessel afferents in intestines. Option B. Nucleus tractus solitoris. Option C. Chemoreceptor trigger zone. And option D. All of the above. You may pause the video for think about the correct answer. The correct answer for this question is option D, all of the above. So all these three are the correct for a ondansetron. So it blocks the vessel afferents in an intestine. It also blocks nucleus tractus solitaris and also blocks the chemoreceptor trigger zone. Let's solve the next question number three. Cancer chemotherapy induced vomiting that is not controlled by metoclopramide alone can be suppressed by combining it with option a amphetamine option b dexamethasone option c hyoscine and option d cyclizine you may pause the video for think about the correct answer so question is like that cancer chemotherapy induced vomiting that is not controlled by metoclopramide alone can be suppressed by combining it with मतलब कि cancer chemotherapy के कारण जो vomiting induce हो रही है वो समझो कि only metoclopramide से जो है वो control नहीं रहो रही है तो आप उसके साथ कौनसी drug जो है combination में use करोगे 
okay so correct answer for this question is option b dexamethasone so dexamethasone is combined with metaclopramide to induce vomiting sorry uh, chem cancer chemotherapy induce vomiting controlling so cancer chemotherapy induce vomiting ko control karne ke liye hum metaclopramide ke saath dexamethasone ko combine karenge question number 4 irrespective of all the types all laxative exerts the following actions the option are increase the contents of solid in a feces option b increase the water content of feces option c reduce the absorption of nutrients and option d increase intestinal motility you may pause the video for think about the correct answer so our today's quiz on a combined questions from the antacid as well as the antiemetics so the correct answer for this question is option b increase the water content of feces let's solve the next question number five for optimum rehydration the molar concentration of glucose in ors should be option a equal to the molar concentration of sodium ion somewhat lower than molar concentration of sodium ion option c somewhat higher than the molar concentration of sodium ion and option d three times of the molar concentration of sodium ion so you may pause the video for think about the correct answer and the correct answer for this question is option c somewhat higher than the molar concentration of sodium ion so for the ors oral rehydration solution the molar concentration of glucose is somewhat higher than the molar concentration of sodium Pharmarox, the way of success is to provide you a study material and model papers on GPAT NIFER DIN pharmacist exam. You may call or WhatsApp us on 9016312020. Here is the next question number 6. The concentration of sodium ion in WHO oral, oral rehydration solution is Option A. 40 millimoles per liter option b 60 millimoles per liter option c 90 millimoles per liter and the option d is 110 millimoles per liter so you will pause the video for think about the correct answer and the correct answer for this question is option c 90 millimoles per liter so the concentration of sodium ion in a WHO ORS is 90 millimoles per liter. Question number 7. The electrolyte composition of WHO oral rehydration solution is based upon that of enterotoxigenic E. coli diarrhea stools, option B cholera stools in adults, option C cholera stools in children. And option D, rotavirus diarrhea stools. You may pause the video for think about the correct answer. The correct answer for this question is option C, cholera stools in a children. So correct answer is option C, cholera stools in a children. Let's solve the next question number eight. Ondansetron is option A can cause extra pyramidal side effects option B is not effective in control of acute emesis option C can prevent the emesis due to radiation and option D is not absorbed orally you may pause the video for think about the correct answer the correct answer for this question is option C can prevent emesis due to radiation so Ondansetron have a ability to prevent the emesis due to radiation. 
रेडिएशन मतलब कि अल्फा बीटा गैमा रेडिएशन के कारण जो वॉमिटिंग इंड्यूस हो रही है या फिर वो दूसरा कोई रेडिएशन पावर है तो उसके अंदर वो प्रिवेंट करता है क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन द प्रोकाइनेटिक इफेक्ट ऑफ मेटाक्लोप्रामाइड कैन बी अवलाइज बाय ऑप्शन ए वेजोटोमी ऑप्शन बी एट्रोपेन ऑप्शन सी बेथाने एंड ऑप्शन डी एसिटाइल कोलाइन यू मे पॉज द वीडियो फॉर थिंक अबाउट द करेक्ट आंसर द करेक्ट आंसर फॉर दिस क्वेश्चन इज ऑप्शन बी एट्रोपाइन सो द प्रोकाइनेटिक इफेक्ट ऑफ मेटाक्लोप्रामाइड कैन बी अबलाइज बाय अ एट्रोपाइन क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन द मोस्ट इंपोर्टेंट ड्रग फॉर प्रिवेंशन ऑफ मोशन सिकनेस इज ऑप्शन ए डायमिथ बेन हाइड्रोनाइट ऑप्शन बी ट्राइपेलेनामाइन ऑप्शन सी स्कोपलामाइन एंड ऑप्शन डी हाइड्रोक्सीजिन यू मे पॉज द वीडियो फॉर थिंक अबाउट द करेक्ट आंसर एंड द करेक्ट आंसर फॉर दिस क्वेश्चन इज ऑप्शन सी स्कोपोलामाइन सो द मोस्ट इंपोर्टेंट ड्रग फॉर प्रिवेंशन ऑफ मोशन सिकनेस इज स्कोपोलामाइन so we have solved this quiz part number 15 from a sub uh, topics antimetics and a antacids from a subject pharmacology and good luck for your result comment your score like share and subscribe our channel for such more educational videos pharma rocks the way of success study materials and model papers are available for gpet niper din pharmacist exam you may contact us on whatsapp 9016312020 you will call mr amar rawal on 9016312020 good luck friends pharma rocks the way of success